go. We're sticking a Culinary Edge TV sticker on the Vixen. So after a while of uh, not catching anything with the live bait, Captain Kenny called an audible and we went in close to shore and tried for an Ono. And we finally did hook up with something and I got myself a chance to get back in the fighting chair on the Vixen. And as I reeled it in, it looked like we were going to get ourselves something to eat. A nice Ono, which is actually the term for delicious in Hawaiian. So I pulled the fish closer. The mate went with the gaff, he went to gaff the fish, and the gaff broke. But, luckily, the apt mate got the, <laughs> got the fish on the boat, even though the gaff broke. Watch the slow motion, you can see the mate goes down to gaff the fish and everything seems fine, he's got the gaff in, but right here the top of the gaff breaks off <laughs> and he's just holding, luckily he had his hand on the other part of the gaff and the fish comes in, it's kind of pandemonium, but man, were we happy to get that thing in because that is what we're going to cook up when we get back to the dock. So when you're fishing at a Honokahau Harbor, you generally raise a flag for whatever fish you've caught. This is an Ono flag we're putting up. And it's cool because when you come into the harbor, you can kind of look to see how the fishing is, what kind of fish are being caught just by the flags that are hanging up. We always catch fish on the Vixen on the Culinary Edge TV. Woo! So at this point, I was really excited that we had something to eat, to cook up at the dock, and actually Ono, or what's known some places as Wahoo, is probably the best tasting fish in Hawaii. We came, we seen, and we conquered. We have dinner tonight. But, we didn't know that Captain Kenny had something else up his sleeve, and that Wahoo wouldn't be the only fish we took back to the dock. And if one day you meet me in person, and you ask me to tell you the story a great fish story about how we got a 309 pound marlin onto the vixen this day. I'll tell you the story. So as we backed into the dock where the vixen sits, we looked forward to a great feast, which is really the other part of fishing with Captain Kenny. Just hanging out, cooking fish, playing music, and uh, just enjoying this very unique spot in Hawaii. Captain Kenny immediately started cleaning that Ono that we caught. And I'm sure he's cleaned thousands of fish on this cleaning table here. And he promised to show us his special Ono recipe, 
which involved Italian dressing, shoyu, and a few other things. So we were psyched to get a chance to eat the ono cooked with the captain's own recipe. So not the Bernstein, but oh, Italian. Cool. This is the secret. This is the secret. Captain's secret recipe. That's right. We're making the oyster sauce, picking up the ono. To make the ono ono, right? Oh, all right. This ono is going to be so good. It will tickle your face when it's... <laughs> <laughs> it means so good, it will tickle you pingly. <laughs> I don't even know what that means. <laughs> hey, 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 cut! Beep! You think you're gonna pick it? Beep! Kenny, we told you about the sponsors! Yeah, the sponsors! Beep! This is bad. Yeah, I got stuck in canola, so you better not put the vegetable oil there. I'm gonna get in trouble. <laughs> Now look at this, beautiful. I said an hour and a half ago you're swimming, this poor guy. Yeah. Mind his own business, here comes the airline. Now look at that. Isn't she lovely? <laughs> <laughs> All right, when he gets done with this, I don't know whatever he's doing there. He's cooking uh, black dog, I don't know what it is. <laughs> you're gonna go. You're gonna fry that up? No, I'm gonna grill it. Oh yeah, that's the top. I get that. Uh -huh. What are you doing, Ellard? I'm gonna fry up some rolls, some Asian style rolls. I got two types. I got lumpia and I got Vietnamese imperial rolls. I need to tell you what to do, Chef. I don't want to go. <laughs> Come on, man. You just tried. Hey, I'm at 50 degrees. You just tried the boat. <laughs> hey, I did my job. I got you a fish. Plus, I got you an impossible fish. When can you be there? You gotta have connection here. You know? Oh my God. Uh, yes. So, Big Marlin, this size, are best smoked, and Captain Kenny has a pretty great um, smoking operation. And so, the next part of the process is to get this fish off the boat and broken down into parts so that we can get it back to Captain Kenny's smoking lab and he can make some magic happen out of this fish. So Captain Kenny, what are you gonna do with the marlin? Smoke. Smoke it. I'm gonna smoke it, you're all heaven. You put a brine on it? Smoke it? Yeah, honey. Honey, honey ginger, garlic, sesame oil, and uh, sugar. So you, and how long do you smoke it for? 24 hours, then I smoke it. There's a lot of action. Rolls, a lot of action. There's marlin yeah. being cut off. Yeah. There's rolls being cooked. Yeah. We got a good crew here. Yeah. <laughs> good day. Oh. Yeah. Oh. 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 O
the episode. Wow. Alright. Wow. That's good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good tasting stuff, isn't it? Oh, excellent. Yeah. What's your favorite fish to eat? Wow. <laughs> this is it. <laughs> wow. I know it's so funny. You know what? And you know what? You can't get it any fresher than this. This is as fresh as you can get it. Mm -hmm. When you stuck your hand in there, the nerves were still moving around. Oh, yeah, my God, it's so delicious. Yeah. Oh, it yeah. Look at that. That is it. Cooked by the captain, too. That's Cooked even better. Caught by the angler. Oh, Cooked by the captain. Caught by the chef. Cooked by the captain. Cooked by the captain. <laughs> Special recipe. Culinary Edge TV. You're not going to eat fish fresher than this, are you, Captain Kenny? No. Our goal, he was swimming. <laughs> then, Alan came and really ruined his day. <laughs> ruined his day. <laughs> but he made our day. How about that, that yes. Superman? Yes. Yeah, take a taste of that, Superman. Okay, wait. You're gonna love it. Oh, wait, here we go. Here we, we, go. Got the, yeah. we got the two fish non eaters. Hey, take a taste. That's so good. Right. Taste it. Mm. You're gonna love it. That is mm. that oh, amazing. Oh, yeah, well, no? Mm. Take you your like buddy. It, Superman? Okay. okay, here we go. Huh? Fresh I don't know. This is the guy that you can get the fresh. You gotta spit the fish up. Oh, you try, you try eat that. <laughs> it will tickle your pinkly. Let's see. <laughs> oh. Isn't that something? Isn't <laughs> it lovely? He likes it. He likes it. He likes it. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Woo. Cheers. Oh, wonderful day. Yeah. Good, Good company. Day. Thank you so much for making us yeah. part of the Ohana. We'll do it yeah, again. The next guys. trip will be an overnight trip, two day trip. All right. Lobster. Yes. All the fish. We'll come back with a grand slam. Woo! Boom. I promise. Boom. Stay tuned for the next episode. Next episode. Fishing with Captain Kenny on the Vixen. Right? Yeah. Kenny speaks, everyone listens. <laughs> All right, everybody. You heard that here. Captain Kenny said, we're doing an overnight trip and we're coming back with a grand slam. I think we're ready. Here we go. Jeez. There's an island across. So as the turtles feasted on some of the scraps we threw in the water and I jammed with the legendary Captain Kenny right behind the vixen on his dock. And we had some Ono grinds, including some Ono and some egg rolls. And everybody got around the table. I just reflected on how awesome life can be and just how important it is to listen to and have experiences with the older people in our societies who are talented, wise, kind and full of aloha and spirit. We all did our way. Oh, Look no. at that. <laughs> For you, this is a genuine culinary edge custom utensil set. Really? Yeah. With uh, this is a bag that we got. We got the uh, material from Fiji. Oh, really? The thread sewed the bag. Yeah. And then it has. It's got your bamboo. Oh yeah. Piece. Oh yeah. It's got. Your culinary edge TV chopsticks. Oh wow! So there you go, buddy. Thank you Thank so you much. Thank you very much. Take it yeah, I'll take it to Idaho. Yeah, yeah. It's, then you don't have you have your own utensils. You don't have to use the plastic. And yeah. All that stuff. Oh, perfect. Thank you right very much. Yeah, no worries. Thank you so much for having us. Oh my pleasure. It's been awesome. When I come back to my happy, we'll do it. For more authentic food adventures from around the world, follow us, like, subscribe, or share. And this is Chef Ellard saying, as always, thanks for watching and happy eating. Come over in the show. When I, when I see them, my heart tells me that I love more than all the little creatures. Here go. From the ocean, shining in the sun.